Well, it's that time of year. The ground's all dried up. We can get out with a truck and we can shoot a few rabbits. Now, I'm using 42 grain hollow points. And we've got night vision set up as well. Now, that's set up on my old CZ American rifle with an AGS air rifle scope. Now, I've added an extra IR illuminator. Now, in the cab, we've got two screens hardwired from the scope. Now, it's all a bit Heath Robinson. But as you can see straight away, it's pretty effective and it's pretty good. Now safety is always a big factor when you're shooting. Now I couldn't shoot this rabbit. It's right up against the hedge. Now just the other side of the hedge is a flock of sheep and beyond that we've got some houses. So I didn't take the shot on that one. Now the one thing of using uh, night vision, you can lose track of where the, the dead rabbits are. Now we don't like to leave any rabbits lying around. We like to pick up everything we shoot. So we make sure we put in a good effort to try and find all the dead rabbits. Now these are all to feed my ferrets, so I'm going for headshots all the time. The reason I go for headshots, you preserve the meat. Now I can take the heads off, cut the heads off, chuck the whole rabbits in for the ferrets. No lead, nice and clean. Now occasionally I do clip one. I don't get a clean kill. Pretty desperate to sort of finish the rabbits off, which I don't kill straight away. Now this one, if you look closely, I slowed it down. I pull the trigger. He lifts his head up. Bullet travels straight under his, his, his chin. So that's the second shot on this one. Now, by this time, I'm pretty eager to kill this rabbit. You know, he's had two shots at it. I've clipped it on the chin. So, a body shot, head shot, anything to kill that one. Again, shoot slightly low. Just prick it under the chin. Straight back on it to finish it off. Um, so what do you think of tonight? What do you think of the show so far? Yeah, it's been good tonight. I think we've got about 20 rabbits, which is good. Um, it's funny because I'm seeing rabbits where I haven't seen them before. And where there have been rabbits in the past, the numbers have gone sort of down. So they're reappearing in different places now. Are they avoiding places where they all died out of RHD and things like that? Could you think? be. You never know. I mean, who knows? Have you had any mixy rabbits tonight? No, not tonight. That's good to know. No. Um, yeah, I haven't seen any sign of mixy at all, which is great. Uh, yeah, as I said, the rabbit numbers are starting to come back, I think. Um, until I start shooting them, they start declining again. <laughs> but now we all, you know, I love your rabbit shooting. Um, and that's why I keep it separate to be ferreting, you know. The great thing about rabbits is they, um, they breed like rabbits, don't they? They do. Yeah, they do actually breed like rabbits. All right. Got my sunglasses, mate. <laughs> <laughs> so that's the first farm done now off up the road to, set the, to shoot the second farm there's quite a few rabbits on this farm as well like I said I like to keep my ferret in and my shooting separate the reason being I love doing both the rabbits on this land the farmers don't actually mind a few rabbits here and there so we're not going out to kill everyone so I've been shooting on these two farms for about 10 years so the way things are going let's hope we can shoot for another 10 years uh, <laughs> Uh, rabbits, rabbits, more rabbits. Um, for what purpose? Mainly to fill my freezer up, to feed my ferrets, really. Lovely job. But I mean, if you get, what, two dozen, how long will that keep you going for your ferrets? A um, few weeks, at least, yeah. A few yeah. weeks, yeah. A couple of months, I suspect. So I don't just feed them rabbit all the time. Um, pigeons, I'll give them a bit of mincemeat as well. Uh, dry food, all sorts of stuff. Give them a real varied diet, really. That's what they want. Well, it was a great night. Thanks for watching. Tune in for the next one, and we'll catch you later. Oh, oh, subscribe! Hit that subscribe button!